digital right 7 comma high so see thing is like uh, this is your Arduino board considering a circuit is there you are able to see there is a motor driver IC for that motor driver IC I need to write the input and output so as I told see actually like I got my Excel here considering a motor is there I got uh, the pin 8 is coming 8 is coming here and uh, 7 is coming here considering I got 7 and 8 so 7 pin and 8 pin if both are high the motor is not running if this one is high and this one is low the motor is running If this one is low, this one is high, motor is running. If both are low, motor is not running. So both are high, motor is not running, both are low, motor is not running. If it is high low or low high, the motor is running. Motor is running. This is how it will be. So in this digital right, 7 comma H. So for this point 7 and 8, I started giving either high low for running or high high for not running. Over here you are able to see digital read of, read of 9. If I click this pin 9, push button 9, so I got a push button here. 9, if I click the push button 9, if this button 9, automatically high low from 7 and 8, the high low signal is coming. The motor will run and a digital read of 6 digital read of 6 is clicking here you will get off the motor so if it is 1 automatically high high will go automatically the motor will be off this is how your digital read and digital write is coming so digital write is like writing something into the IC reading is reading the data from the hardware this is how your digital write and digital read will be. And before that, we have to give the pin. This is the input I'm getting, right? So, digital read of 9 as input. Digital read of 6 as input. And here is the output I'm sending out. So, this is made as output. So, these things you need to write it in the setup. And uh, the rest of things you need to write it in the loop. This is how your digital read and digital write will work.